Oh, hey, YouTube. Let me just turn my music off. What's up, guys? Didn't know I'd find you here. Anyway, it's a good thing you are here because I think it's about time I give you a little update about where I am. As you saw from the intro, I'm not in Vancouver anymore. I'm in Montreal. Voulez-vous parler un petit peu de français, mon ami? <laughs> I gotta brush up on my French a little bit, guys. I'm in the city in Canada, the, la the largest city in Canada that speaks both English and French. <laughs> en français. <laughs> and what I'm doing here is, well, starting a new beginning. This is where Nari and I moved last week, June 1st. We got our new apartment in Montreal. You know, I've been traveling so much these past six months or so, I haven't had a proper base. I haven't had a place to live. Last real base I had was Mexico City, you know, back in 2018. And it's kind of caught up to me. I've realized, you know, it's great to travel and see all these places, but after a while, you want a place that's familiar. You want a place that's home. And I haven't really had a home for a while. I've just had places that I've stopped by to visit. Nari, as you guys know, has been apart from me for quite a while as well. You know, she went back to Korea, I was traveling around, and we both planned to come back to Canada and move back to Vancouver. But, um, fun fact about Vancouver, it's, it's one of the most expensive cities in the world for housing these days. So, since we both work online, and you know, my videos can go wherever I go, and since I still plan to continue traveling, it doesn't really make sense to live in the most expensive city in Canada right now. So we both talked about it. We had a deep conversation and kind of thought about the future and decided, well, why don't we try Montreal? Why don't we try somewhere new? A new adventure for both of us. Um, and speaking of adventures, we had quite an adventure on our way to Montreal. That's actually going to be in my next video, which is going to be talking about a five day train ride we took all the way from Vancouver to Montreal. It really was an unforgettable journey. I'm excited to share it with you guys. I hope you enjoy it. And yeah. This is McGill University right now where I'm filming, by the way. One of the main universities in downtown Montreal. It's got a lot of cool, older looking buildings. There's a castle behind me that kind of looks like Hogwarts. But uh, yeah, the point here today is just to let you guys know, I'm in Montreal. Oh. I'm in Montreal. Awesome train adventures coming up next. And yeah, I'm just excited for this, this new beginning uh, for us living in Canada again. I mean, it's always a bit of an adjustment period in your life when you go from long-term travel to slowing down and staying in one place again. But I think it's, it's, it's necessary. I mean, the more I travel, the more I start to value having, you know, a base and a place where you can feel at home. So every time you travel, you have that home to come back to. Because when you're constantly traveling and you don't have any home, you, you well, it's easy to feel lost and kind of a, you know, like what's the point if you have nothing to go back to, you know? So for now, at least, Montreal is going to be our home. Uh, I'm going to brush up on my French. My French is about as good as my Spanish, so... <laughs> Más o menos, as they say in Mexico. Más o menos. Anyway, guys, that is it for today. I'm getting rained on. And yeah. Hope you guys are excited for these upcoming videos. And if there's anything in particular you'd like to learn about Montreal or about Canada while I'm here, leave a comment. Let me know. Man, I gotta get some AirPods. These. Okay. See you next time, guys.